the first uh, inspirational video we're going to do for this channel, and it's the gospel, really quickly, in two pages on a Word document. Here we go. So the Bible tells us in Romans 3.23 that all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Sinning is like missing the mark. God is a holy God, and he, he commands um, obedience out of us, and he's given us his law, and we are to keep his law. And we can't fully keep his law perfectly, um, and if we fall at even one point, we're guilty of the whole law of God, as it says here in James 2.10. The cost for this is death. Um, the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. So what we get for sin is death, which is really means separation. So separation from the body. So our soul lives on and our body dies. The Bible tells us that we cannot be, we, that we're justified by faith apart from the deeds of the law. So the law kills the spirit gives life and we need um, faith in order to uh, get away from this curse or this this cost um, that sin brings because we are all going to die but there's separation the eternal separation that can happen if you die in your sins now the gospel that's preached by jesus is right here. He says, the time is fulfilled, the kingdom of God is at hand. Repent and believe in the gospel. Repentance is it literally means a change of mind. Okay? That change of mind is going to result in a change of direction. That's why you see people who are Christian and live a different life, their life changes after. This is the same gospel that the Apostle Paul preached. If you go to read Acts 20, you'll see in Acts 20, 21, he testified to Jews and Greeks, that means non-Jews, repentance towards God and faith towards our Lord Jesus Christ. So we must repent of these sins and what we thought was our, going to be our way to God. Um, we need to agree with God and stop going the way we are going. Change your mind and agree with God. We are justified freely by his grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. So it's a free gift, salvation. He doesn't ask anything from us. He's done it all. It's all done in Christ. And our God is patient and loving. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, and he's not willing that any should perish, but all should come to repentance. So God wants you to repent, and he wants you to get saved. Only through his Son, the Lord Jesus Christ. And there's only one mediator between God and man the man Christ Jesus.